of word wisdom was really encouraged by your presence here on tonight. We thank God for each and every one of you. Amen. Your presence encourages us and we thank God for your faithfulness and commitment to God on tonight. Amen. For the Lord has been and his goodness is all over the earth. Amen. So we thank God for the many wonderful things he did for us on today. What he did for us on yesterday, what he did for us on Monday, and what he has done for us all of our lives. Amen. The Lord is kind and good to each and every one of us. He blessed and prospered us to be together again on tonight with the word of Wednesday. We welcome you tonight to Word of Wednesday. We greet you tonight in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. So magnify the Lord and let us exalt his name together. Amen. Let us make us and not be ourselves. Amen. So we thank God on tonight. Amen. Thank you, Pastor. We appreciate you, your ministry on tonight. Amen. Oh, magnify the Lord. He let us exalt his name together. For it is he that has made us and not we ourselves. Amen. It is by his hand that we are fed. He has kept us. He has saved us. He's forgiven us. He's graced us, forgiven us, and set us up on a rock to say to stay. And we thank God for the chance to be together on tonight. Amen. To thank God. We begin tonight with the 30 days of prayer. Uh, we begin with day 17. We wish again Pastor Lindsay and Samson Granger a happy birthday. Her birthday was on yesterday. Amen. We're grateful to God for what God is doing in her life. Day 17 from the 30 days of prayer. And they read, any power that wants to attack the Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's Church worldwide in the night or at any time, let the ground open up and swallow them in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Holy Father, clothe the Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and your church worldwide with the garment of fire in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. The root of impossibilities be uprooted from the Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and your church worldwide in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Wicked eaters of flesh assigned against us fall down and die in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Parasites, viruses, and bacteria of infirmity, our bodies are not your habitation. Die now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let our bodies be redeemed from the power of sicknesses and diseases in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Power of hardship in our bodies die in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every evil decree upon our destinies die in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every enemy of the work, every work of the enemy in our lives catch fire and burn to ashes in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Our portion stolen by the wicked, we recover you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Arrows from the dream, Hear the word of the Lord. We call you out of our bodies in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Arrows disallowing our prosperity from gathering come out in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. The resurrection power, power that cannot be defeated, come upon us in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, arise and deliver us from satanic detention in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Evil marks suppressing our glory die in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Our Father, do good things we have never done in our lives before in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Agenda of corrupt leaders for our land be nullified with the blood of our Lord Jesus in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. You dark stronghold in charge of sickness and disease in our land. Fall down and die in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We use the blood of our Lord Jesus to sanitize our land and cleanse it from every which sponsors sickness and disease in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. You dragon power behind this pestilence, we bury you forever by the power of the blood of our Lord Jesus in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Strong man behind this pandemic, 
We bind and cast you out of our nation in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Father. Thank you, Lord Jesus. And thank you, Holy Spirit. We pray next to prayers for Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church. Those prayers are from July 23rd, 2021. And we'll begin praying with prayer number 35, also referenced as power as prayer point number prayer point 35 which is simply number 35 as well uh, which is page five on the book that i have those prayers from july 23rd 2021 to those who are joining us via facebook or youtube when you see this if you desire a electronic copy of these prayers simply just inbox us the email address and we will send you a copy of these prayers please include uh which prayers that we're praying that you want a copy of so that we send you uh, the correct ones. Let's begin. We counsel every enchantment and divination against the ministers of the gospel of Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and your church worldwide in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every marine agent assigned to bring down the members of Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's church worldwide. Receive open disgrace and defeat in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, let your winter revival begin to blow across Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's Church worldwide in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, prepare us and send down revival in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, be unto Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's church worldwide, like a wall of fire round about, and the glory of her midst, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Lord, we thank you for your mercies upon Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's church worldwide, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. All those making evil pronouncements against Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's church worldwide, Holy Spirit, Release your security angels to track them down and silence them in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every enemy of Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's Church worldwide fall out and die in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every satanic counterfeit set up to divert believers from Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's Church worldwide be exposed and be disgraced in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every enemy of the Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's Church worldwide, scatter and die in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. O oh God, arise and uproot anything. Do not plant inside the Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's Church worldwide in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Fire revival. Fall upon Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's Church worldwide in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Holy Father, may Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church, a citadel of holiness, wonder, healing, miracles, and glory upon the earth in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Holy Father, bring the workers of your choice to Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and keep all of the evil agents away in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let the fire revival fall upon Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church and the Lord's Church worldwide in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every baroness and Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church will root you by fire in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. We buy barrenness and we lose fertility and abundance and the womb of Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church is open and lively in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every impossible situation surrounding Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church, it is written that with God all things are possible. Therefore we speak unto you, the growth of Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church. Come forth, come forth, come forth, come forth, come forth, come forth, come forth. Come forth in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every air of unproductivity fight against Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church 
We command you to return back to sender by force, by fire, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, favor of God, make a way for Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church where there is no way, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, Lord, let the spirit of favor baptize Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, thou that troubles the Israel of Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church, the God of Elijah shall trouble you today in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Any invisible cover on Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church catch fire in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Any cauldron called in the name of Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church be broken and destroyed in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every curse operating against Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church die by the power and the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. No weapon of satanic enchantment and divination against Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church shall prosper in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Holy Father, let uncommon and unusual doors of favor with men be open for Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. By the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church shall rise to the place of prominence in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every satanic monitoring gadget assigned to Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church catch fire and burn to ashes in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Father, let the five God consume every altar of affliction raised against Golden Triangle Christian Fellowship Church in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Father. Thank you, Lord Jesus. And thank you, Holy Spirit. Amen. We thank God on tonight. Amen for his miraculous healing power. Amen for what he can do, for what he will do, and for what he has done. Amen. Amen. So we thank God. Amen for his being here with us. Amen. If you just join us via social media, we ask you to please on tonight share this uh, Facebook live. Amen. To your new see so others may hear the word of God on tonight. Amen. So they may be enriched by the preaching and teaching of God's word on tonight. Amen. Amen. Thank you, God. Amen. We appreciate God and many, many wonderful things that he He's doing on magnify the Lord. Let us exalt his name together. Amen. Amen. Let's stand to our feet and prepare and praise and worship the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus the Christ. Amen. All right. We really love him tonight with our soul, our mind. He's such a good God. He's such a good, good, amazing, great, rich, mighty God. Amen. And he made this to love us first before we ever got here. Your dead man's love that never ceases. Come on, let's sing it together. I really love you. I really love you.
Amen. We thank God for you on tonight. Amen. 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 All right. Oh, that one is, um, let's turn this one down. I cracked it up some on the white one. Yeah. Amen. Thank you, Pastor. Amen. Amen. We thank God on tonight. Amen. Amen. Oh, yes. Glad to see you on tonight. Praise Amen. God. Amen. As you turn in your Bibles to the book of Genesis, uh, chapter 8, verse number 1, Genesis, chapter 8, verse number 1. That's in your Bible app or in your paper Bible, as we refer to Bibles with pages. All right. Amen. Both are good. Amen. Nothing wrong with either one. Amen. For the word of God is the word of God. Amen. We encourage you to get a version of the Bible that you understand and that you can read. Amen. Amen. And then we encourage you after you do that to read it from cover to cover. Genesis 8 and verse number oh, eight. 1. Uh -huh. Genesis 8, 8 and verse number 1. Genesis is the first book in the Bible. Amen. Amen. That's what it means. It means beginning. Uh -huh. Amen. But we encourage you to read the Bible from Genesis all the way through Revelation. Why, Pastor? Why? That way you know what it's the Word of God Hell says is. in its entirety Amen. for itself. Amen. Amen. You don't have to be an old Christian, which means you have to be saved for a long time to read God's Word. All Amen. Right. You run into the names, go on, tear the names up, and just keep going. Amen. Nobody's going to hold it against you. It's not a reading class because you're not just reading uh, just for the sake of pronouncing words right. Amen. You're reading to receive uh, revelation amen. from God. What's revelation? Amen. Understanding from God. Yes. Praise God. Amen. Amen. A lot of this stuff that you see going on around you will make sense if you read God's say word. Right. Amen. That way you're not lost. Amen. So we encourage you. We say that every time I get up, I say it. Every time I pass it up, he's saying it. Why? Because Christians need to read. The word of God for themselves. Amen. Let's pray. Let's shout out to God. Our Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for your presence and your power. God, I thank you for this opportunity personally to share with these your people. Now, God, I ask you to take myself and to be less of me and more of you, less of me and more of you, less of me to us all of you and none of me. Not unto my name, but unto your name, oh God, be all the glory, all the honor, all the majesty, all the dominion, and all the power. Heavenly Father, we thank you for answers on tonight. I thank you, God, for bonus, accurate articulation of speech. I thank you for perfect utterance. Yes. I thank you, O oh God, that no sentence of my own is you, none other than what the Spirit of God would dictate. Yes. O oh, Heavenly Father, God, show us in your word that we are winners, we are victorious, we are more than conquerors. Yes. God, set us on a rock to stay tied down. We need to be torn down, build us up. We need to be built back up, restoring to us the joy of our salvation. Take our depression and anxiety and give us your peace. Take our deadness, oh God, and revive us, oh Heavenly Father God. Yes. Give us a plan for our confusion, yes. oh God, yes. bring peace and contentment to our hearts and minds through yes. Christ yes. Jesus. And God, most importantly, we thank everybody that gets saved on tonight. We thank for those that yes. come back to you on thank tonight. You, we thank you, Father, for those that get spirit-filled on tonight, healed, delivered, and those who are added to the Lord's church worldwide and here at this local church, Golden Triangle Christian yes, Fellowship sir. Church, yes, all who agree with their prayer said amen. Amen. amen amen genesis amen. chapter 8 uh, verse number one reading to you from the king james uh, version of the bible and it reads and god remembered noah yes, sir. and every living thing yes. and all the cattle that was with him in the ark and god made a wind to pass over the earth and the waters assuaged all the waters started to go down. Yeah. Tonight I want to talk about God remembers. Mm. Once again, God, God remembers. remembers. Say it again. God, God remembers. remembers. Uh, God does not make a promise that he forgets. And the objective tonight is for you to know that God has not forgotten what he told you. Neither has he forgotten what he said and he still will perform his word and make it come to pass yes, sir. And you need to be aware of that and keep that on your mind and keep that at the forefront of what you see in spite of what's going on yes. pastor says this way for every crazy thing going on 
in your life, God is doing something super magnificent. Yes, sir. On the opposite yes, side. Sir. Yes, sir. So we have to make the willful, on purpose decision to focus on what God is doing. Yes. Amen. Not what the enemy is doing. You know, a lot of people want to say they say the devil is busy. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. And my five back is all the way, but what are you doing? What are you yeah, doing? yeah. That's what, what, what is that's your good. posture? What is your yeah. stance? Are you fighting yeah. him back or yeah. you just let him roll on you free of charge. Are you oh are you getting God. in your licks? Are you getting your lick back? All right. What, yeah. what are you doing? Yeah. Retaliating and counterattack and yeah. attack the enemy uh, as well. Because Pastor has taught us, and as he teaches us, you're in the fight with the enemy, whether you like it or not. That's number one. Yes, you're in the fight, whether you want to be or not. Yeah. You're in the fight, whether you you need to be or not. You're in the fight whether you're ready to be or not. Nick, do you yes, want me to keep going? Regardless yes, of how you feel about it, you're in that. You're in that. And whether you like it or not, you want to be identified as it, you might not think that you're that great, you're that wonderful. It's not about great and wonderful, but you are a public enemy, number one, to the enemy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Why do you say that, bro? Pastor, we show it to you in scripture many times how God protects. Children when they are babies. Yeah. From edicts, from Pharaoh, and then we get to the New Testament, we see them being uh wanted to be slaughtered by Caesar. Yeah. That the command went out that all babies two and under would be killed. Mm -hmm. yeah. When it was in the old testament, it was just a two-year-old male, and then you get to the New Testament, it's just a two-year-old baby. The Bible said yeah. everybody was crying all over the land. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Herod, thank you, Pastor Thank you. Herod was crying out. But what are you saying, Pastor? That God always will protect what's His. Yes, Because yes, yeah, a lot of children died. I don't mean no harm, and this is not to uh, negate other children. But He made sure that the promised child stayed protected, and God will make yes. sure the promise stays protected in your life. Yes. yes. Noah, uh, he becomes a type and a symbol of Christ, as many individuals in the Bible are. Amen. He is right. not the Christ. He's just a symbol, a type. You're going to give you an example, a prototype, a sample, if you will, yeah, because right. God uses him. Yeah. The Bible said that God couldn't find a righteousness nowhere on earth, but that Noah found grace Come on. Right. Come on. in God's <laughs> life. Yeah. And child of God, I say it all the time, that we never outgrow the need for grace. No, we never sir. outgrow. I'll teach, oh, I'll evangelize, I'll bishop, I'll pastor, I'll prophet, I'll prophetess, I'll, I'll deacon, I'll lay member, I'll pew member, whatever you want to call it, the need for grace. You can't have too much money where you need grace. Yes, Don't God. need grace, excuse Woo. me. You're always going to need grace. grace. That is yes, the unmerited God. favor of God. Is God not doing to us yes. what is rightfully should be done yes. unto us. You do not outgrow the need for grace. Nope. Right. But you see here in the text that Noah does his part. He builds the ark yeah. to the exact specification that God tells him to build it to it. Yes, God sir. sends yes, the animals to him yeah. to get on the ark and to crawl in and say, not all, but just enough so that when things started over, yes, there will be enough to replenish <laughs> and repopulate. Yeah. Yeah. I want to say that on tonight while I pass by that part. God always know how to restart your life. Yeah. All right now. Now, God knew he was going to flood the earth. He already knew what he needed to do yes, on the side with wildlife and insects. Because he understands yeah. there has to be a certain balance yeah. in the environment. Help yeah. me only those wildlife yeah. talk. Yeah. That's why pastors always teach, I always teach that you don't catch God off guard. Amen. Because he already knows what he is going to do. You may not know what you're going to do. All right. I can recall he had a many times my grandfather, Lady Reverend Willis, he would say, God ain't never made a mouth that he couldn't feed. All right. Now, now you might can make one and you need some assistance, whatever. God don't make one that he can't feed. He said, if I feed the birds of the air, yeah. Yeah. ain't no bird never come rapping on your door. Hey, 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 y'all got something to eat now? You got, you got some crumbs or something, you can right. slide to me or whatever. Yeah. And truth, I, to this day, I still don't know how birds find what they look for. I don't know if it's a sight, smell, or whatever it is, but yeah. some and or type and or kind of a way, yeah. they're going to find what God has for them yeah. in the earth. Yes, right. God gives them what Grandpa would call instinct. instinct. You know, when the word is instinct, but, you know, it's an instinct with me. God gives them the ability to find what he needs without being taught. Yeah. Right. But as humans,
humans, God expects us, of course, we have to do our part, but God expects us all to also to believe and lean on him yes, for providing Amen. for us. Yes, because we're not in this by ourselves. Amen. Amen. We're not in this by ourselves. It may feel like it. It may seem like it. You may feel like an island. You may seem like you're on an island. You may feel like it's just you. You're the yeah. Lone Ranger. You know, you're just out here in this wilderness all by yourself. But like oh, Jesus yeah, said, Jesus himself said, I'm alone. And he thought about it. He said, No, I'm never alone. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, so it's not predicated on how we feel or what yeah. we sense, you know, because you can't always feel God. I'm glad that I can feel them sometimes. Yes, I, I, I ain't mad about that. I'm glad I can feel them sometimes. I, yeah. I, I ain't mad about that, but I don't depend on my feeling to know that he exists. Amen. Right. Amen. Because a lot of people, they want to say, well, if God is real, I need some sense, real evidence of his being real. Okay, we step outside the church, get away from the Bible, just look around you. Mm. Look around. Yeah. I mean, who makes dirt? Yeah. yeah. Dirt. Dirt. I mean, just dirt. Man. Don't go no further. It's just dirt. dirt. Uh -huh. And who can program dirt? Well, whatever is put into it is going to try to break it down and make it grow. Yeah. Who can come up with a mind like that? Who that? I'm just saying for your thinking on tonight. You look up in the sky. Why is the sky blue from up here? But if you look from it down, it looks black. Why is that? So we can't just deny God's existence because we don't feel him. Amen. But everything that he did is all around you, yes, seen sir. and unseen. Yes, Say it all the time. God made a world. Yes, yes, I mean, why did he decide to make water yes, wet? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> come on, come on. Yes. Do you understand? And then yeah, he makes yeah. it, he puts it on the inside of us. Because you gotta have water on the earth, so you gotta have water in you too. You gotta have water above, so you gotta have water yes. below the ground too. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Who decided that? Why did he decide? That's why the Bible says, "Who are you to tell me what to do?" Come on. Yeah. Who are you when I started speaking the world into existence? Where were you when the stars sang unto me? Yeah. Yeah. In other words, before I had praise and worship, before there was a language to be yes. spoken on the planet. Yes. Yeah. The stars were talking and singing about me. That, that, that's a mighty man. But that, that's who our God is to us. Yes, Say, God remembered Noah. Yes. Now, the funny thing about that, Pastor, uh -huh. Noah wasn't the only one in the boat. All right. All right. His wife was in there. Yes. His three sons. Yeah. And their three wives away. But say, God remembered Noah. 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 And sometimes, child of God, God saves the house because yes. of you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Pastor. Sometimes God skips over certain things yes. because of you. Yes, sir. That crazy yes, Bishop Noah Jones, yes, he says it like this. I always wondered it for years, and I expressed it in the pulpit how it is, how God hears a mother's prayer. He says it like this. And I quote him. He said, he said, he said, a lot of times, he said, God will have mercy on the child because he does not want that mother to experience what that child would have to go through. Wow. And I got it right then. I understood yeah, right there. Yeah, that, that yeah. God don't want you as yeah, mama yeah. to suffer yeah. in that. So because of you, yeah. yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. Yes, sir. God has mercy on that child. Yeah. It's a very simple picture to understand. God had mercy on us because Jesus Christ yeah. died on the cross yes, by sin. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You, you couldn't have paid your debt. I couldn't have paid mine. No. Amen. No, no, no. Now, now we, we, we couldn't even last that long up there. Most of us wouldn't have even made it. Through the, through the judgment hall situation, we would have passed out right then. Right yeah. Then you got to get beat and bleed all yeah. night and then try, still try to climb up on the cross and, and die Lord, Lord. Lord. in front of an African son, in front of everybody, mama, and, and all your homegirls and mission supporters and everybody looking at you. People were talking about you. Oh, yeah, we'd have been yeah. died. Yeah. 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 But he had to go the way he went for you and for me. Yeah. Yeah. So the picture's not that far away from us. I say it's a lot more God in us than we realize. Yeah. Yes, See, a lot of times we get the picture and we try to think that we got more devil in us than we got God. Oh, no, right. no, 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 no. Right. You're right. God's right. child. Yes. You, we contend with real. flesh. We wrestle not with flesh and blood. We understand those types of things. We fight against principalities and all this other stuff that go on in the atmosphere and right here and beside and around of us that we don't see. We understand that part. But it's a lot of God in you too. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's saying God remember Noah. Thank you, yes. Lord. 
And then that's yeah. enough to get excited about right yes, there. Yes, yes, sir. Because the Bible didn't say that Noah was living so righteous like that. Say so he found grace. Grace. Yeah. yeah. In God's sight. Yeah. Yeah. In other words, God loved him. Yeah. And had mercy on him. Say, I want to use him. Yeah. And it's okay that God wants to use you. And say, and God remember Noah. Yeah. And every living thing. And all the cattle that was with him in the ark. All right. Wait a minute. God has yeah, mercy right. on him. Yes. Every living thing. Come on, come on. And the cattle that was with him in the ark. God had mercy yeah. on everything that was alive inside yeah. the ark. Yeah. I'll say it again. God had mercy on everything inside of the ark. Again, yes, say it again. Sir. God had mercy on every living thing inside of the ark. He said he thought about it. Yes, yeah. Now, now, wait. I, 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 I can't take this no further. Oh, that, that's Noah down there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And sometimes the Lord said about you, that, that's Sister Deborah down there. That's, All right. That's Mr. Right. Bird down there. That's Pastor down there. That's, yeah. That's, that's, that's Ruben yeah. down there. That's, that's, yeah. that's, that's Lizzie. He has to come say that to himself. Say, God, yeah. remember. Yes, yeah. sir. No. Yes, sir. It's like you, you punish your child. You only going to take it so far because you remember that's your child. Yes, sir. All right, yes, sir. All right. Yes, sir. All right. Say, God, remember knowing every living thing and all the cattle that was with him in the ark. Yeah. And God made a wind yes, sir. to pass over the earth. Yes, mm. God cut the fan on. Yeah. <laughs> yes, and said that's enough of that. Yeah. Yeah, that's enough. And the Bible said that the water stopped falling from the sky. Yep. It stopped coming out the ground. Yep. And from everywhere else the water was coming. And they said that the water went down gradually. Mm -hmm. Okay. Like say the water went down. Right. It, it yeah. took some time, right. but the water went down. Say it again. The water yeah. went down. Yeah. What does that mean, Pastor 2020? That means things was getting better and closer back to being normal. Yeah. 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 Noah wasn't raised on no ark to be all up and through with animals like that. Yeah. All right. The only time we see it in scripture. Well, a, well, man is that close to animals all the time is when Adam names all of the animals that are on the planet that God brings before him. Yeah, all right. yeah. So here he is. He's placed in this situation he's asked to be in, uh -huh. but this is the situation that God uses to protect him. All yeah. right. All right. Scripture says like this. His ways are not our ways. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. God did not take him out of the storm. God protected him through Thank the flood. You, he protected him through yes, sir. the flood. Yes, he God was. gave him the wherewithal to build. He gave him the plan. Told him what to use. What was going to last. How big to make it. And who all was going to be on there. Right. And yes, this is how this went. Yes, yes, sir. Sir. Yes, so, so, so when I obey God. Yeah. God does not forget about me. All right, oh, now. God. All right, all right now. And because he remembered. He cut the fan off. And the wind yeah, started blowing off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you know there ain't no fan in the earth. Now come on, at least it's not that I know of. But, it, but, it, but it, you know what I'm saying? It's an analogy that God turned the wind. Yeah. Made the wind start blowing off. Because it's not the first time that we see the power of God move on the water. Yeah. We see it back yeah. again. The Spirit of God hovered. Yeah. Moved over the face of the deep. Yeah. So it's not like God is not moving, not used to moving over water. Yes, right. You see, water is symbolizing instability. All right. Okay. What does that mean, Pastor? God can stabilize you in your unstable environment. Yes, sir. Okay, yes, so God can stabilize yes, you in your unstable environment. Yes, he can. Say it again. God can stabilize you in your unstable environment. Yes, stable sir. environment. Say it again. God can stabilize you in your understanding. That's why you hear me say when you hear me say at times like this, we need an anchor. You need somebody that can hold you, yes, that sir. can hold on. Yes, sir. Because everything we got can't hold on. All right. So I'm yeah. say your money get wings and fly. Yeah. Yes, sir. You, you you go to spend it and it ain't that. All right. that you can't unlock it. You forgot the code. Lord, have somebody me. hit the wrong button. Yes, sir. Somebody scam your account, you ain't on something. Yep. Yes, yeah, but you say put your trust in, in me. Yes, sir. See, don't even, we don't have to see. See, according to the text, we don't see nowhere where the, where the text say uh, after the flood that, Mo, that Noah trusted God. All right. All right. All right. 
Uh, Everything that was coming was coming from God's side. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You ain't been there before in your yeah. life. Well, God just looking out for you just yes, because sir. he's God. Just well, God yes, coming for you just because he is God. Well, God is looking out for you just because yeah. you are God. It ain't saying he didn't want that Noah started praying nowhere. Yeah. All right. Oh, Lord. Yes. Lord, Lord. But right. the book says he lets us know ahead of time what was preserving him in this situation. Right. And that statement was that Noah found grace. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, Lord. yes, sir. With God. He found oh, favor. Yes. yes, he did. With God. Why? Yes. God had to get rid of some things in the environment that wasn't right. Your yes, man, man, mankind was too wicked. Yeah. Fallen angels had to did too much corrupted things. Yes. Yeah. The second history part for the Bible, you know, you find that in the lost books of the Bible. You can read about it on your own time, whatever the case may be. But God had to wipe her clean of that. Yes. Yeah. And he starts over with Noah and his sons and their wives. Yes, sir. Right. But God was not lost, even though things got messed up. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. God yeah. was not lost because things got messed up or get messed up. Our divorces don't throw God off. Come on. Our Come sin on, does man. not throw God off. Our on, mistakes man. don't throw, off, throw God off. No. Okay. Our shortcomings don't call, c c cut God off. No. That, that, that ain't what does that. No. Come on. We put the wall up between us and God. But that don't mean God ain't got a plan. Yeah. That does not mean he don't have a way out. Yeah. That does not mean he will not help us. Because if you can find yourself in some stuff God ain't, can't get you out of, we got a problem. Right. And I want you to come tell me personally. Yeah. And we, I won't like the first match to burn the church down. I would like the first one. Yeah. But what I know to be true is that whatever I get in, God can yeah. bring me out. Yeah. So you got to understand that God can flood this whole planet. Yes, sir. No matter how big or how small or what the shape is, you believe it is, and he made the water to build X many feet yes, over the sir. tallest mountain. All right. And he can do all that and allow the water to go back down. Yes. Yes. And let everything dry on the planet. Right. And then everybody walk back out and start back living. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do, do you see? Because yeah. if you're just looking at the water, this ain't going to ever be right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good preacher right there. If you if you're just looking at the water, this ain't gonna ever return back to what it was. It ain't gonna ever be sweet like it was. It's not gonna ever happen like it was. I'm not gonna ever be as blessed as I was. Oh, but you got to look past the water. Preach, preach. mean, look past the water, baby. You still got the room. I like the way David said because I like the posture that it puts your eyes right there. He said, "I will look to the hills from All which right. comes my help." He's talking about that. I'm looking up. He ain't looking at no hilltop. Sake of looking at no hill, he wasn't no hill up there. But what he was saying, I'm gonna look up to God. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yes. That song told the truth. He said, When I've done all I can do, I look to you. That's a good song, yeah. yes, because you'll find yourself in life. You ain't got nobody to turn to. That's right. That's right. I mean, you stuck, not that you can't move, but who you want to call, you can't call, who you need to call, they don't want to answer. Come on. Who need to call you? They too scared to touch you. Yeah. Oh, talk, Reverend Sapper, on tonight. Come on, come on. The one that you need to call you can't find your number. Yeah. Yeah. The one you thought would call about calling you and check up, they forgot about you. Oh, yeah. Or they like my mama friend that time. They too busy enjoying the blessings of the Lord yeah. to call your name before the Lord. That's why you better talk to the Lord for yourself. Yeah. Depending on nobody to pray for you, pray for your whole self. I ain't waiting on something. Ooh, child, I got to tell such because they can get one through. You better get one through for yourself. Yeah. Quit letting the devil trick you. Yeah. Thinking that your prayer is going to work. Ooh, thank you. The devil is a lie. If you pray according to what the Bible says you can pray, yeah. what's some of the things that say you can pray? You can pray, you can pray for yourself to be healed. Yes, sir. Yeah. Pray for yourself to be delivered, be yes. set free, yeah. to prosper, to do better, to do the will of God. You don't need nobody else to pray. You pray for yourself. Be free on tonight and pray for yourself. Thank you. For the reason why you can't come out because the wrong one praying for you. All right. Yeah. Ain't nobody listening. <laughs> Say it again for the people in the back. You praying and asking the wrong one. Talk to God about your God. Yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, it's just. It's, it's just, it's, you know, it, it, it be so much. God ain't got nothing but time. All right. All right. <laughs> what you mean, pal? 
The book says he neither sleep Woo! nor slumber. That's right. Nah, the only thing on that. But, That's but, right. What that mean? He don't nod. Nope. He don't nap. He don't take siestas. He don't oh, right. lay down for a while. He don't stretch <laughs> out. He don't get the itis after he done. Yeah. He, he don't have them issues. He yeah. just up. Amen. Yeah. Thank you yeah. And the best one for me to tell him about me is yeah. he. Me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Cause you better learn to pray for yourself now. Yes. While you can learn and you got a safety net. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Lights. Amen. Why you say that, Pastor? Because that person that you depending on to pray for, they might leave here. Or they right. might lose their mind. Right. I done seen it happen too many times. I just be watching. I say, Lord, this is a whole man. Yeah. I just on the planet, yes, yeah. here, yes, got a mind, but yeah. don't have their right mind, but they got thoughts, yeah. and it's not the thoughts that they need to have, yeah. but they got thoughts, and the spirit man still work, because you'll find them laying hands and holding your hand praying for you, yeah. and you don't know what they're saying, but they know what they're they saying, know. and God know what they're saying, yeah. but they're not in their right mind. Yeah. Yeah. Where you going to put that? Yeah. That's why I tell you, you learn to pray for yourself now. Yeah. Cause something happened to big mama, you gonna be lost. Lord have mercy. Yes. Lord have mercy. Yes. Help somebody on the name. Yes. yes, sir. Why, Pastor? Yeah. Why? <laughs> because life is real. Yes, it yeah. is. And it changes in the twinkling of an eye. Yes, it does. First be here today and down tomorrow. Oh yeah. my lord. I've seen the great power yeah. turn into the weak and the puny. I've yeah. seen it. Yes, yeah. sir. Yes, sir. Strong and burly. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We can pull, and it don't make no sense. Like this was the same yeah. person I watched yeah. 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 do X, Y, and Z. Yeah. Th there's the same one almost break my hand, shaking my hand. Yeah. yeah. And they still got their strong strength, yeah. but they ain't got no mind. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I tell you, get to know the Lord for Lord yourself. Yes, so God can remember you. Yes. That's what make the Lord remember you. Yes, All right, now. Is that He knows you. Yes, <laughs> okay, let me let me, yes, let me pose sir. a question because I'm on the way to my chair right now. Let me pose a question. All right. Pose a question. Ask it, brother. Somebody that you met last year mm -hmm. for the first time. Uh -huh. Do you remember them people? Oh my God. Like you remember your childhood partners? No, I'm talking about your childhood. I'm talking about the ones y'all rode the bikes in the alley yeah, with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You understand? The one y'all used to hop people's yards to get to their fruit trees. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I'm saying. See, we, we, we come into God's house and get to the family of God, and we act like God is so different. Oh, my. Ooh. Oh, my. Oh, wow. That book say, call me while I can be found. Yeah. Call me while I'm near. Cause we, we we get close to that day when he ain't gonna be close if you ain't close to him. All right, oh Lord. Oh Lord. Right. Yes, sir. If that day coming, he's gonna separate yes, the sheep from the yes, goats. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And the sheep gonna go this way. Oh Lord. And the, and, 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 and the goats gonna be left here. Oh, right. And hopefully, hopefully some type of way they find their way to him, is all I can say. Yes. But it's gonna be hell to play on the planet. I tell you, get to know yes. the Lord for yourself. Yes, sir. Be yes. leaning on nobody else. Yes, sir. For God to do for you. Amen. Talk to him for yourself. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Heard Pastor talk about it. Heard my grandfather talk about it as well. In the natural, you got problems with the IRS, the best person to talk to him is you. That's right. Yes, sir. It's the principles are the same. That, 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 that's what always gives me. The principles are always the same. You got to advocate for yourself. You got a case on a lawyer. Here we go, yes, Pastor. Sir. You go got ahead. a case with a lawyer. All right. You better tell them what you need for them to do. Yeah. yeah. Don't yeah. just leave where you going up to them. All right. Yeah. You better research and read for yourself yeah. too as well. Yes. Sir. Ask the Lord to give you wisdom. Yes, yes he will sir. be a lawyer in the courtroom. Yes, yes he will. Sir. I'm a witness. Amen. Oh, Hallelujah. Yeah. Lord, he do it. Yes, he will. <laughs> but, but, but you have to help yourself. Yeah. Tonight. But why? Because God will remember you. Yes, yes, sir. See, that's a water type situation. That's a flood type situation. We're going to look at the wipe everything out about your life. My oh God. my God. <laughs> He'll do it. He'll do it. Yes, 
God will remember you and just blow the wind. Yeah. Yes, sir. Woo! Yes, sir. And the water starts going down, down, you, Lord. down. Thank you, Lord. down. Thank you, Lord. Now, the ground still got to dry, but the water yeah. is going down. That's why you hear me say, it's getting better every day. Every day. Yeah. <laughs> the pastor, yes, I don't know if the Lord going to remember, baby, that's how you hear tonight because the Lord remembers you. Yes, sir. <laughs> Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. You might not know it. You might not believe it, but I'm here to tell you tonight. I'm not going to go. God remember you. Yes, sir. He, yes, sir. He, and why, why does he do that? I don't know why God does a lot of things to you. Yes. Yes. Some stuff I'm convinced and I know it is because of who my forefathers were. Yeah. And yes. their relationship with God. Yes. And it does matter. That's why, I, that's why I try to tell people, do for God. Do for the people of God. Yes. Be a blessing while you can when you can yeah. and all this other kind of stuff so if this thing go on longer than we think it is yeah. your right. children got something with God that yeah. others might not have all right. Yes, all right. All right. so we don't talk about it much but it still matters yeah. yes, sir. It matters. we might not do it much but we know it matters yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. all my mama just used to feed the preach they didn't have much but I bet you all them children heard that yes, the grandchildren are doing okay yes, all right. sir. you doing yes, alright <laughs> yes, sir. And all of them don't be saved and spirit filled, no. tongue talking, no. baptized with fire, and on their way to glory like they did, but they be fine, though. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Why? Because it's a principle that God honors. Yeah. Right. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you. See, the difference was between the New Testament and the Old Testament. Yes. In the Old Testament, when, when, when the time came, they said they killed all the male babies. They had some midwives delivering babies. All right. All right. Got to the New Testament, you don't hear about that no more. Amen. There was no buffer between. Yeah. Lord have mercy. Yeah. So all God can do, take the baby. Y'all yeah. go hide in Egypt till I tell y'all to come out. Yeah. All right. So the scripture might be fulfilled out of Egypt, Africa, have I called my son. So, my Lord. Amen. You preaching. Come on, child of God. Yes, sir. God remembers he ain't forgot. Amen. Oh, the works of my hand command you. Hey, hey. Me. Ah, yes, sir. Tell me what I say. Yes. Sir. Maybe y'all don't do this. I do this one. Most of the time. Somebody be like, Mr. Sanderson, I need to say, 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 okay, I need you to remind me of that tomorrow. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. But text me when it's time for that to happen. Yeah. 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 Why? Because I need you to remind me of what I told you. It's not that I forgot. I remember what I said. But I need you to remember what I told you. And it's the same thing with God. It ain't that much difference between us and God and the Father. I'll be trying to tell you tonight. God will remember. He, he will remember you. When you see nobody, no one being no great prayer person, uh, you understand? He preached. Yeah. 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 All them hundred twenty years, however long it was before it flooded. Yeah. yeah. But you ain't hear about that no more again. Next time you heard about him, he done planted away and Lord, he back in there drinking again. <laughs> 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 you, do you I mean? Do you understand? Great big mighty man of God. Hey, God started hey. all creation with him. He built the ark. He proclaimed that it's gonna rain and da 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 And all of that, and then he get back down and then go, oh, Lord Jesus, he done, he done found the body. All over the Lord But God had gave him grace. Yes, sir. Yes. Sir. So that, that, that grace you can't put a price tag on it. Oh, no. my Lord. Oh, my Lord. You, you can't put a price tag on it. But give it's valuable. It's valuable. Yes, sir. Yes, it is. So, Pastor, what is it that I'm to do for God to remember me? Do what he right. tell you to do. All right, now. Yes, sir. See, so what I know about God. I had the experience on that. I never told you this story, pal. Uh -huh. One person, and I'll tell them about some things I went through or whatever, this and that. And she looked at me and she said, Boy, you the golden job. <laughs> I said, I ain't even seen the whole movie. Yeah. Didn't even know what it mean, but I knew what it meant. All yeah. right. God it. kept me for a long time. Yeah. In a yeah. special way, in yeah. spite of. That's what that God remembers you. Yes. See, God remembers eight-year-old Reuben yeah. that wanted a tape recorder right. to just record his daddy's sermon. Yes. 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 
See, God hold on that type of stuff. She's like, you sentimental. Don't think God ain't sentimental. Oh, Lord, Reverend Sam, talk tonight. Don't you think God ain't sentimental? They say, God remembered Sarah, and God remembered Yes, sir. Hannah, do you, that, it's in the Bible saying that God is not the right to forget your work and your labor of love. That's all yes. that's the same. Yes, sir. Amen. Why is it the same? Why is it the same? Thank Why you, Lord. It? Because Thank God remembers. Yes, yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. You may be sitting in your ark with all the crazy hell going everywhere. The elephant's wow. trumpeting, the rabbits is tripping, the snakes yeah. is sliding, the roaches is on the wall, oh the birds is talking and chirping yeah. all night long. You can't yeah. get no sleep, but God remembers, yes, and He desires God. to have a relationship <laughs> with you. Come on, man! Thank you, Lord. Thank you. It does not matter what your situation is, yeah. all the water is in your life, you yeah. can't swim it, all you got, to, all you doing is just sitting in the, in the ark until days get better and God opened the door, Jesus Christ yeah. decides to have a relationship yes, sir. Yes, sir. Why does he want a relationship with me? Because he loves you like that. Yeah. How do you know? John 3, 16 says it, but God so loved the world. That he gave his only begotten son. And whoever believes in him, they will not perish and they will have everlasting life. Yes, Jesus Christ desires to have a relationship <laughs> with you. Yes, sir. Yes. You may be the Noah in your family. Oh, Jesus God. Christ Jesus desires Christ. to have a relationship with you. You may be one of the animals in the ark. Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. desires to have a relationship oh, with you. You may just be a living thing. Don't know where you're going. Lost in the way, can't find. Away, can't see the way, can't smell the way, or see the way. Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. desire to have a relationship with you. How do I get a relationship with God? By accepting Him as your Lord and Savior. Yes. How do you do that? You got to believe with your spirit, man. That's your eternal part of you, and believe with your heart and confess with your mouth. It's just that simple. Coming to God is not difficult. People may want you to think that it is. They may want you to believe that it is, but it's not. But with the heart man believes, and with the mouth confession is made unto yes. salvation. And the only thing that really can help us, that really changes our lives, is the word of God. That's why we say Jesus Christ desires to have a relationship with you. Because he yes, wants to God. change your life. He wants to help you turn your life around. He wants you to be able to see life different, that there is another way, there is a better way, there is a cleaner God, way. God wants you there. Want but all you got to do is receive him. He don't. He ain't worried about your raggedy ways. Just come to him, yeah. and yeah. you and him can work that out. Because scripture says like this: "Come, let us reason together." Which means you and God, oh, God. y'all can work through it together. Yes, sir. He will take you. Your sins can be bloody, scarlet, red. He will make them white as snow. Which means like it was never, ever that. It does not matter where you've been, what you've done. Jesus Christ desires to have a relationship with you. So if you say yes tonight, I want to be saved. You can be saved. You can know it. You can experience God, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit in your own life in a personal way. And you can have your own testimony that God remembers yes, you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You, you. You really can. Yes, you can. You, you've heard others talk about he'll do this and he can do that and won't he do it and yes he will and all that. But God wants you to have that experience your own self. So you say, yes, that's me. I want to receive Jesus Christ in my heart tonight. I want to be saved. Yes. Or maybe you done lost your way. Ah. You fell by the wayside. You, 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 you ain't coming to church. You're not watching online. And, you know, life got busy in some type of way. You just, you just lost track of time and, and you don't pray. You don't read your Bible. You ain't take communion in a long time. You ain't been to an online church. You ain't been in the building in a long time. But you want to come back here because you realize that that's what's missing. Jesus yeah. Christ desires to have a relationship with you yes. all over again. He can make all things new. So that's you say, yes, I desire to be saved on tonight. We pray a simple prayer. I can't believe for you, but I can tell you the word to say. I can't believe for you, but I can lead you to him. Yeah. So if you say, yes, that's me, I desire, I want, need to be saved. Ask you to repeat this prayer for me. That prayer said, dear God, dear God I know without Jesus the Christ that I'm lost. That I'm lost. I, believe your word. I believe your word. That if I confess in my mouth, the Lord Jesus, and believe in my heart, 
that God has raised him from the dead, I shall be saved. I now invite the Lord Jesus Christ into my life and receive you by faith as my Lord and Savior. I'm sorry for my sins and I thank you for your forgiveness. Jesus Christ, you are my Lord. I'm now a new creature in Christ and a child of God. Thank you for saving me in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. And just like that, you're saved if you pray that prayer out loud. If you wanted to come back to God and you pray that prayer, you're back in good standing with God right now. We encourage you to read your Bible from Genesis all the way through Revelation. Amen. On the Bible app with the paper, Bible, that's fine. We encourage you to get water baptized, which is the outer symbol of you have received Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. Amen. If you want to become a member of this church, you can go to our website, visit www.gtclc.org slash email where you can become a member of this church. You can inbox us and say that you want to be a member and we'll receive you as members we're going to get in contact with you. But we love you. God loves you. And we desire God's best for you. So if you say, all oh, tonight, what else should I do as I've been saved? Tell the world about Jesus Christ. Yes, sir. Tell them about his love. Yes. Let them